off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us Enjoying prepping? This is like when everything kind of gets... It's a lot of apples. Like Pandora's box opens. I had a list and I've been wanting to get these apples cleaned up from the garage. We never made applesauce. Some of you have been asking for a video. <laughs> we never found the motivation. I just chucked out a whole bunch of apples that have gone bad. In order to prevent the rest of these from going bad, I have washed them all in my sink. It was a sink full. Good, good amount. Um, but I have plenty of time today and it'll make the house smell amazing. So I think what I'm going to do is make the rest of these apples. I've got the kind of small ones here for us to eat. We've got bigger ones here in the sink. I think I'm going to take the bigger ones and make a batch of crock pot applesauce. I want to show you that it's super easy. I don't want to do it on the stove top because I don't want to have to... Makes a mess. Well, I don't, yeah, I don't want to like... No, I mean, I don't want to have to babysit it. If I put it in a crock pot, I don't have to babysit it. And we're close enough to Abby's surgery that I can probably keep it good in the fridge. Um, and maybe water it down with some actual apple juice and she can drink it. So... That's what I'm doing, and it's Thanksgiving Day, and I purposely look like this because I'm going to shower after I do all this. I'm going to take out the big apples. So, that's what we're doing for Thanksgiving Day. But, the table's set, the food is made, and, you know, we're just kind of killing time at this point. Meanwhile, Jason is de-icing the fridge. Yeah, see that little... So, fun way to start Thanksgiving. <laughs> But Jacob did just bring me a, a candle. He just got here, brought me a little candle. So that was very sweet of him. Okay, the kids are over there playing Tenzi. I am finishing up in the kitchen here. This isn't a tutorial for applesauce by any means. But you core, slice, chop, peel your apples. And I forgot that I'm not sitting them, sticking them through a little strainer. So <laughs> I forgot that that's the most annoying part of, part of doing this by hand. But you just stick them in a pot. There's a little layer of water in there. I'm gonna come back in about a half hour and see if it needs more water. You put your lid on it, you put it on high, and you let it, ooh, that's hot. And you let it cook. I'm just gonna let it, let it just marinate. And I just stir it all day and Eventually by tonight, we will have applesauce. All right, I've showered. This is as ready as I'm gonna get today, but I wanted to show you the status of the applesauce. We'll just kind of show it to you throughout the day. Nothing official, but here's where it's at right now. So if you added lemon juice to this, or actually squeeze some lemons in it, um, it doesn't brown, but this is partially why I don't do it this way. One, because I don't have enough crock pots, but it does brown. Um, more when you do it this way just because they're more exposed to the air But when I do it with my strainer, it, it presses it really fast then um, The apples don't have a chance to touch the air and they don't go brown, but we'll uh, We'll we'll touch base with this throughout the day. Okay, we're playing cards now And I'm teaching them how to play nerds and I just pulled out all of my cards and look they're all from either Maui or Hawaii. So cute. So I'm going to teach you. We were playing Rumi Cube and Jason's asleep on the floor. One. We got this one. Over, yeah, there he is. And Kaylee's, Kaylee and Abby are upstairs resting. All right. Okay, we got to put the nerds away. Kaylee, or the and, Abby. Kaylee, Kaylee and Chelsea. Chelsea. Yeah. Okay. with any family holiday event. Not much filming happened. <laughs> a lot of talking, 
a lot of eating. Everything went great. Um, family has gone back home. They're, they live out of town, but they want to stay at Grandpa's house tonight. So, we are just finishing up cleaning up and I'm just going to turn on movies. Half of our kids have a headache. Where's... Anyway, I thought that was something from behind me. Half of our kids have headaches. I think Chelsea is one of those and she's up in the shower. They were fine until about, I don't know, half hour, 45 minutes ago. So they have both went up to their bedrooms. Kaylee is over at Jacob's. She gave us half a day. So we told her she could go over there after dinner and dessert and have dinner and games or uh, dessert and games over at his house. It's just the world you start to be in with kids when they get older, I guess. So, um, so it worked out great. We had a good time and the food was excellent. They brought stuffing, make cornbread stress stuffing because she has a gluten intolerance, my sister-in-law. That was really, really good. And then my father-in-law brought the turkey and they brought rolls, homemade rolls and Brussels sprouts and um, lots of pies. We had like a boysenberry pie. Kaylee made two apple pies and pumpkin pie. And I think Jason's dad took home his apple pie because ours was better. <laughs> um, Okay. Oh, and we had a big veggie tray. I didn't film any of it. What you saw on my plate was the only thing that you, that you saw. Um, but we had a big veggie, veggie plate. One thing I always do at big family parties now is if you're having raw veggies, just put it on a platter and put it out first while you're still cooking and prepping and getting things ready to go for the dinner. The veggies are going to be gone because everyone wants to nibble. <laughs> the vegetables are all gone. I think we only have carrots left on the plate but I put a lot of carrots on the plate. So um, that's a little tip to get your kiddos to eat veggies. It's just to put it out when they're not allowed to snack yet. So I'm gonna get cleaned up and then I think maybe our Thanksgiving night is over. The kids did learn um, the game Nerds. Ashley still wants to play it, but the other two kids that know how to play it have headaches. So I don't know if we're gonna play it again tonight. I really would like to play it, but it's not easy to play it with just two people. Maybe I'll teach Jason us how to play it. Maybe I'll convince him to play it with us. We forgot the Seahawks were playing tonight. So we're watching that. Ashley's not feeling so good. She went and did Anyway, she went and took a bath. She's not feeling so hot. So I forgot I was going to tell you guys how this applesauce is doing. Here it is. Actual applesauce. So you can tell it's really dark when you let the apples, it's a little chunky. I have it still turned on, just on low because I don't want to burn it. I'm going to get Ashley some fresh, warm applesauce to help her tummy from Jason's gas, but I don't think that we had a good score there. All right, get her a spoon. See if she likes this. I'm gonna taste it really quick. 